absolutely. And that and that is the whole idea of this. It's it one, it makes us makes the dentist uh, more confident of what his diagnosis is because we're not filtering this image to get it clear and and get the di to a diagnostic point. So anything you see on our image is really there. It's it's not artifact. Uh, and so that that alone lets you diagnose what the problem is and diagnose it clearly. Anytime you can get more clarity in an image, you're going to make a more confident diagno a diagnosis for the patient, which is again what what the whole idea is. Get it right the first time and get the patient comfortable or get the patient uh, treated. Um, it, as Constantino says, it's a quantum leap. It's also a quantum leap in, in dentistry for that reason. Now, the other is the, the no cord, and I'm going to show you what this, this, this is all this is, is this big, is there's no worry about breakage. There's no worry of, of the cord. There's no worry about the tug that the cord brings. So the patient comfort that we're getting is incredible. Um, and we've designed these zero profile holders that clip onto the back side where the battery is. So there's nothing surrounding the edges to create the dig into the tissue, floor of the mouth, the roof of the mouth. You get all that complaint from the patient. So now the patients aren't fighting you, you're controlling them, which makes your job easier. And mostly the dentists themselves aren't taking the images. It's, it's the hygienist and the assistants. So the assistants are happier, which makes the dentist happier. So the workflow in the office is just moving, 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 and you're not having the retakes because you're able to place it in the spot you need it without the patient fighting you. So that's the kind of stuff I found uh, initially when we, I first started using this in my office and my son, with my son, is we were, we were getting the one shot and getting the image and, and we were done. And we were getting a clear one where we could see everything we needed to diagnose the problem. And the patient was happy because they were only getting one x-ray rather than two or three sometimes you gotta take to figure out what's going on. And is it for PA and bite wing? PA and bite and bite wings and the, for the bite wings, the incipient decay, it jumps at you and you can magnify without distortion to a huge area. I mean, I, I, I was blown away when I when I first started zooming in because normally you zoom in, you start getting that, um, uh, you know, the distortion and, uh, um, you know, the graininess. And here you can zoom way in and it's still cr crystal clear and you can see little sections of starting incipient decay and you know it's it's not an artifact you know it wasn't it, it wasn't uh, over processed like some of these sensors have to do to get a good image and, and that was in itself uh just made your time speed up because you looked you saw you diagnosed and then you were confident about it you didn't have to well we're going to watch this for a while you're not, you know it's there. So we're gonna not watch it, we're gonna treat it and do a better service for the patient. 